everybody welcome to the Firefly Studio 67 okay today I've got a journal to share with you guys and this is actually part of my <laughs> friendship journal um, I had such an amazing response guys this is volume one and I don't know how many there's going to be because um, the you know I'm still waiting for a few more entries that I know had shipped. They haven't arrived, so I did it, agree to extend it until the 15th. But on the 15th of April, I will do the drawing for the prize. So um, I just I felt like, you know, it wasn't fair when I knew because of the circumstances, post has been delayed. So anyways, guys, so having said that, there are still a couple more entries. And so that's how... Um, you know, this is, I'm going to have, I'm going to have a lot of journals. I'm just going to say that because, um, well, you'll see. Um, so anyways, I made the cover of this again out of the envelope. It seemed the best solution for this because it's very flexible. But I added to this, this was a charm that um, my sweet friend from down under, Andrea, um, sent to me in some happy mail um, a while back. So I thought, well, I'm going to expand this journal into um, happy mail, things I've picked up along the way, and, you know, beautiful things like this. So I've added that to the <coughs> spine <laughs> um, because these tend to be kind of rounded. So, um, so let's just jump in, and I'll show you this one, guys. I've got... Um, I've got this one complete, and and then, like I said, um, oh, I just don't even know how many this is going to end up making. It is, it's really surprised me, I'm going to be honest, um, the response, and I'm so grateful, guys. It is amazing. Okay, so, going inside here. Now, uh, what I've had to do, and you, you know, if you entered this, you may recognize maybe um, a couple of things I've had to shift around. Um, I know that this was in one of the um, entries, but I've had to shift things. So <clears throat> for me, like I said, I wanted this to to be a place that I could put things that I've received from people, you know, throughout this journey. And the other thing for me that was super important is, you know how I told you when I start working with my buttons, that some of them I just, I start a little hoarding pile? <laughs> well, these were some of the buttons that I was like, oh, I really like that. I've got to keep that because I've never seen such a big, um, that's a mother of pearl. And isn't it fabulous because it's got kind of a charcoal. So <clears throat> this one, I suppose, um, was more of the nature themed, but not necessarily all. Um, so, you know, I thought, well, these kind of go in with that. But the other thing I wanted to say was this was an Artie Mays image. And this was from her spring because the challenge took place in spring. So... That was another thing. Everything needed to have a meaning for me. And this was a good place for me to display my, you know, my little hoarding buttons. And I've done that in one of the other journals. But I won't get to the other journal today, guys, because I want to I want to just uh, leisurely go through this so that you can see how it came together. I ended up just doing one signature because <clears throat> in my mind I was thinking, oh, well, I can put two signatures in these, but... Honestly, everybody's been so generous with their pages, and they were massive. So I've only actually ended up with a few pages in this. So there's going to be a lot of journals, guys, a lot of journals to share with you. And I won't pull everything out because during the um, entries, I did all of that. So this is just a general flip through so that you can see how I incorporated things together. And as I said... Um, I have had to take a few things out and I'm putting them in pockets and I hope that nobody's upset by that. Um, it just, it, it, it was the only way I knew how to do it. Uh, so yeah, I'm really, I really, I love how this came together. 
like I said, I tried to put more pages and it just was so gator mouth that I couldn't even close the journal. So, um, but aren't they just, I, I just think it's all just come together beautifully. And uh, I did try to make sure, you know, things were coordinated. I may not be able to always do that on some of the pages. I don't know, but I'll do my best. Um, so there... And then this was that beautiful page from Nancy that had the dimensional, and that had to be in the center signature, so I'm loving how that. But yeah, you can see the greens and the purples have really come together. Um, so yeah, I'm just delighted, because it, now that it's in a journal form, it's easier for me to now, um, because I was so worried about everything falling out, and it was a, a challenge, I won't lie to stitch these together without losing pieces and you can it's so easy to forget what went where um, so that was the main thing was getting everything in and now I feel as though I can pull this out in the evening and see I've got I've got little notes that people you know I've kept it all I just love it I love this it's such a great keepsake guys thank you all so much so much for this it's just a treasure now here I am going to probably put um, another big pocket back here I just hadn't got around to it so I did want to share that with you guys and then that's the back of it and of course it's been beeswaxed um, so as I said it just um, it's going to be I will match the pages up as best I can but again it's going to be kind of an eclectic mix because I didn't um, ask for a specific theme because I wanted everybody to have the freedom to do me a page in what they were comfortable with. Um, and then again, um, like I said, I, it was just super important to me that I was able to tuck away little things that people have sent me along the way. I had some happy mail um, you know, during the time I've been in this community. And then this, I just love that. Um, so I wanted to share that with you guys today. Um, in fact, I've got time. Let me go ahead and show you the other one. I have managed to get two. So that's volume one, and then this is volume two. And again, this is um, gifted to me from Andrea. Now, I know Andrea did not make these. Um, I, I was corrected on that, and um, so, but I, what a beautiful, beautiful charm. So, again, the envelope seemed the best solution for this. Now, I'm not saying that all of the journals will be this done this way, because I don't know. I might, you know, during the course of gathering them up, I might find another way that, <clears throat> but this... Because, you know, some of the pages were a little bit bigger than others. It just seemed to work the best. And, like I said, I could still kind of close it so that there's no worry about things falling out. And, again, front, um, these buttons kind of spoke to me. <laughs> and so I needed to save them. And, uh, again, I can add things. Um, you know, I've got things in a drawer that... Once I get all the journals together, I'll start tucking things here and there. So again, just letting you guys see everything. Um, just beautiful. And you can see, so that's one, two, three, four. Four entries guys that's that's all I could manage I tried five on this and I couldn't get the flap to come over so I just had to put it back down to four, four pages and bearing in mind we're up to what 50 50 entries I think and I don't know how many you know if I'll get a couple of more in um, I think I'm looking at oh I, I genuinely think I'm looking at about eight journals, which is awesome, but I had no idea that, uh, you know, I was going to have to, you know, I was thinking, oh, probably a journal. If I'm lucky, now I'm going to end up with about eight, so I am so happy. So there's volumes one and two, and as I complete them, guys, I'll come on and share with you um, 
how you know they're um, progressing with them but I wanted to share that guys um you guys have a great weekend and I'll be back very soon take care bye